as I said, if the people were going to beat me again, so the knife was in my own left hand. So as, we are, as I told them that they shouldn't beat me again, if they touch me, I'm going to win it. So I just carried my hand. I just stamped the, the knife uh, to, uh, in his body, but I didn't know the actual place. The knife touched him. So as I just hear the sound of the blood, because they, as if they opened the tap water, as I had this, uh, the sound of the blood, I just ran away. So when I ran away, they didn't run after you. No, they they run after the Doug and, and the Baba. So when I ran away, so when I slept at uh, Aguda throughout hey, the day. Aguda. I yet We too. No, I I, uh, I just slept at the one of this shop. I didn't know. Shop. Sure. Yes, outside the shop. So okay, so how did the police get you? So on um, when I when I now. Go to uh, when I now reach the Lansing bus stop. When I see that that place is too, is too open, that uh, the people that knows me or that had about it may see me. So on my way getting back, at enjoying that I should go and pass maybe a, a, a street whereby it will be very okay for me to to go. On my way going corner whereby there was a big you know, big bus. So stand nearby it at the other side so that they won't be able to see me. You know I didn't know they have already. Send me there. So when the motor stopped, when I see that the motor stopped, and I quickly started running. When I now run, so one guy, one one big big guy that has not, you know, when they were now pushing me, I've not even run too much before the guy just bounced on my front. So we are now, so I was now caught. Everybody shot. That was the place. He took me to the police station. Now, yeah. when that fight started and those guys started beating you, why didn't you go to the police, report to a policeman or something? The last time uh, something like that happened. So when some guys now started the fight, something like that. So as I was separating the fight, a guy that was, that was holding bottle, so we were holding the guy to, to, to leave the bottle. So on, on actually, trying to stop the fight. So when I, when we owe the guy, so immediately the guy just did this way. So the bottle, I turned my hand. So when I went to the police station, I, I, I what police were telling me is that uh, they gave me a uh, police report a bit to go to the general hospital. But they were, I was asked to, to, to be given 3,000, uh, you know, for them to, to follow me and arrest the person. Whereby, and at that, I gave I, I, uh, the money I have with me then, I gave it to them, whereby I now went home. So that was why even my mind doesn't go there to go to the police station because I didn't have that kind of money. If you find yourself in a similar situation like that again, what will you do? I swear to Almighty God, I, 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 I won't even wait. So, what do you have any advice for? You know, some people are just specialists in street fighting, street gangsterism, or whatever they call it. You know, they just, all they do is fight and look for trouble in various street busters and all of that. What kind of advice will you give to them? My advice is that fighting, you know, uh, what fighting is it? Is that when the thing started and when Satan is pushing, is you know putting putting something that is not that is not on their mind to do they will be doing it when we are fighting it started but where it will end to as 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 i am as what happened to you me don't know where it will end. Yeah, we don't know where, to, where the fight will end to my name is balogun nurudin just to come and uh what can i call it come and be to police to release the the cause of my brother to my junior brother for burial. Can you tell us a little about who your brother was? What's the name of your brother anyway? About Uli Fashola. I don't know much to say about it because uh, it's my junior brother and it's a type I know doesn't find trouble but most of them will know much than me because uh, me and him is not a uh, 
age me, but um, what can I call it? But I know the kind of life is a leaf. What this happened to him, I don't, I don't believe it. But you have to take it by. And that, that's the God who wants it. That is what I can say. How does the family feel again about this boy now? This boy that did this? You mean my own family or? Your family, yes. My family, what we round up that if the police can give us the, the body, we should go and bury that. We don't want to do any case. Okay. So the boy should be left to go? Police can desire on that one. I don't know what. For me, I don't have interest in that. For the family, you don't have any interest on the any case. So, you be careful, sir. That is what I can be very, very careful. And for me, I don't enjoy in fighting. What do you enjoy? What do you engage in fighting? You, are, you, you don't, you don't, you don't enjoy something there. So. Uh, what I would say that you very be very be careful. The youth in Nigeria to desist from committing crime and getting involved with people of dubious character. Our youth in Nigeria should understand and know that they would be the leaders of tomorrow. And it is of paramount importance Therefore, that they should run away from committing crime and engaging themselves in acts of either vandalism, hooliganism, or any act that will portray them as bad uh, people. They should be obedient to the lawful, to lawful authorities, obedient to their parents, obedient to their leaders. They should try as much as possible to run away from engaging themselves and joining bad company so that we can have a peaceful, prosperous nation where our youth could be, uh, uh, we could uh, be proud of our youth and proud of our country.